कल्चर पर दोष और कल्चर पर योग हैपन्स टू एन इंडिविजुअल्स लाइफ वेन टू प्लैनेट्स राहू एंड केतु आर मैलिफिक इन देयर बर्थ चार्ट दिस कल्चर पर दोषा इज एसोशिएटेड विद वेरियस नेगेटिव इंफ्लुएंसेज एंड चैलेंजेस इन अ पर्सनस लाइफ इट ब्रिंग्स अबाउट ऑब्स्टिकल्स डिलेज फाइनेंशियल डिफिकल्टीज रिलेशनशिप इशूज हेल्थ प्रॉब्लम्स and overall struggles in various aspect of one's life to give you a few examples from the time you gain sense for example you have been treated like a black sheep of the family or there has been no attachment with parents or suddenly a death happens of a loved one without any major reason a divorce takes place you have all of a sudden lost your job with no fault of yours suddenly your children has separated from you a situation arises where you have lost your business completely in other words you have become zero no matter how much good you do dirt will be always thrown on your reputation you start losing respect no matter how hard you try your earning decreases every day you lack motivation and you lose confidence people try and take advantage of you every time and suddenly you cut off all the people around you and you become alone with all this your mental health and physical health suffers to a great extent one can also try committing suicide in this period in other words no matter whatever you try in this universe nothing seems to work for you and nobody seems to support you every step happens to be a roadblock it is this period where people turn into alcoholics and drug addicts and even some take their lives Rahu and Ketu are malefic planets when comes between your planets in your birth chart influences this kal sharpa dosh the effects of kal sharpa dosh lasts for 18 long years and you become a victim because you do not know the solution it can make one person cry tears of blood every day to get rid of this effects of kal sharpa dosh individuals follow certain astrological remedies and rituals this includes performing specific prayers reciting mantras and conducting rigorous puja the long lasting pain and suffering ends here at trombakeshwar temple in nasik 28 kilometers from nasik is trombakeshwar temple one of the 12 jyotirlingas the place has captivated seekers of truth for centuries once inside the big dome of the temple a hallowed silence envelops you The sanctorum houses the revered shivalinga a symbol of divine energy and cosmic consciousness the trombakeshwar temple is renowned not only for its religious significance but also for its deep mysticism it is believed that the temple's unique location near the black stone of brahmagiri hills at the confluence of three sacred rivers the godavari the vaitnar and the kapila enhances its spirituality energy manifold it is the only temple in india where lord shiva vishnu and brahma is worshiped together and it is here the only place in india where the most powerful puja is conducted for removal of kal sharpa dosha there are some old rules for this puja this puja is done once in a lifetime to remove all hurdles from one's life caused by the malefic rahu ketu placed wrongly in one's birth chart it is also said to remove all karmic debts and make a person free of all his anxieties and sufferings first of all you have to make a phone call to one of the purohits who lives inside the temple premises mostly the chandwarkar family conducts these powerful pujas at trombakeshwar temple once you contact them they will send you a calendar with dates you have to choose a date and block it for those in service please apply for your leave and book your tickets in advance because in such period any kind of obstacle is possible once you reach the temple check into a hotel there are plenty of affordable rooms available in and around the place packed with food practically from all the states of india next morning you should get up with the sunrise and take a dip in the energetic kushavarta kund it is a centuries year old powerful kund with vibrant energies 
men will have to change into new dhotis and women in new salwars and sit for the puja. One has to be completely empty stomach for this puja. Diabetic patients, please consult with your doctors because it is a long four hours pujas on empty stomach. You have to be really physically fit for this puja as standing up, sitting down, bowing down, turning 360 degrees and sitting in various postures along with making continuous offerings and reciting mantras is a part of this rigorous process of this puja. You cannot make a mistake here. You have to be extremely disciplined and conscious every moment. The puja is conducted at a sacred place inside the Purohit's premises. It is divided into two parts. One is reciting mantras and continuously offering milk, curd, saffron, sandalwood, flowers, betel nut, grains and much more ingredients to the various manifestations of Lord Shiva. And the second part is reciting mantras and continuously offering ghee into the fire kund. Both has various body postures while making the offerings. This has to be done with accurate precision and perfection. Once the puja is over, you have to pay a donation of 2500 Indian rupees and donate the clothes which was worn during the puja. And while leaving the temple premise, one should never look back. It is like you have thrown all your past suffering and never want to look back at it again. There's a total different energy about this puja. You will seriously feel relieved of all your problems. Please remember that Kal Sharpa Dosha Puja is only for those whose Rahu and Ketu are malefic in their birth charts. So kindly visit your family astrologer and find out details about your birth chart before booking the date for the puja. My email is in the description box for those who want more details about the puja, kindly email me. Please do like, share and subscribe if you like this piece of information. It just might help you. See you with another story very soon.